Hey YouTube, Chase Variant, coming back at you like a revolution. I got some books from last week and some books from this week. Let's get started. Okay, uh, that is Marvel Comics 003 Hulk, starring the She-Hulk. Nifty little lime green cover with uh, the Grey Hulk just ripping the K out. That is the A cover variant. Bought it this week because I knew it would still be on the shelf. Another Marvel book from last week or not even last week, but last month uh, at some point that I picked up this week is Running With The Devil Kingpin number one. I raved about it in my Kingpin video, so uh, check that out. I bought another one because I got the Matt Rosenberg signature and the COA on that. Another book not from this week is DC Rebirth Super Sons number one. This is the A cover variant. And, um, you know, this really didn't appeal to me in general. I just picked it up because I did get the uh, Peter J. Tomasi signature and the COA on that. And the last of the books from previous weeks would be Batwoman Rebirth, DC Comics, uh, number one. And again, another book I raved at in the video that I bought it and hauled it in. I picked up another one because I have the James Tinian the fourth signature and the COA for it on that beauty. Okay. Books from this week are DC Universe Rebirth, Batman number 18, I Am Bane story arc. And this is the third part of the I Am Bane story arc. This is the A cover. And this winter, DC Comics has been knocking it out the park with their A covers. And this book is no exception. This book is drawn magnificently, penciled magnificently, inked just so well. The shadowing is just so gruesome and, and foreboding. And you've got your uh, venomous luchador with the Red Hood, uh, Nightwing, Gordon, and Robin right under his boot like he likes them. <laughs> and that is uh, the DC Rebirth Batman number 18, I Am Bane number 3, A cover variant. Okay, and I picked up uh, from Titan Comics the Hard Case Crime imprint, Walter Hill's The Assignment. This is the A cover, and this is the third issue. This is the final issue of The Assignment, and the story arc does uh, terminate in this issue. I know I've titillated a couple of you with this particular um, run of books, and I just want to correct myself ever so slightly. Uh, the first issue of the Hard Case Crime, The Assignment, had five different variant covers, not four. So that's five different variant covers. It did print about 5,200. The second issue had four different variant covers. It printed about 4,200. This is the third and final issue of the story, and I'd imagine that it will print under 4,000 issues, and this one only has three different variants. And this one that you're looking at now is the A cover variant. I also picked up the B cover variant. Did not see the C cover variant, by the way, kids. Haven't seen that in actual life. Uh, this is, again, Titan Comics, uh, issue number three of Walter Hill's The Assignment. And this is the B cover variant. And I love, love, love this kind of uh, this moody um, maroon color that, that, the whole, that the whole cover is cast in. And it shows Frank with his girl or her girl with a bottle of Jack. And the look on Frank's face, just you know that she's getting ready to go and kick someone right in the balls. And this is a great story. If you guys like gritty noir stories, check out the check out the assignment. And another book from this week I picked up was Marvel number one, America. And this is uh, the A cover. And this is the first solo book for America Chavez. America Chavez is the new Miss America. She became Miss America in 2011. And uh, she's been in a couple different groups, Ultimates and other things. And um, this is her flying solo, pun completely intended, because of the American eagle on her evil Knievel jacket and that eagle on her chain. Awesome! Just really cool, and she's grabbing someone by the, by the, by the collar, ready to give them the knuckle sandwich. And that is Marvel number one. America. A cover variant. Okay. Another book picked up was Boom Comics, Boom Studios rather, uh, Mighty Morphin Power Rangers number 12. 
This is the C cover variant. It is described as the, I think they describe it as the bring out the bad guys cover. And it is a virgin variant. And it appealed to me for a lot of reasons. One, because it's a C variant, it's a, it's a variant. And two, because it's a, ver it's, a, it's a virgin variant. And three, because, you know, Power Rangers kind of heating up. Plus, I love this cover. I just really love it. I don't know if that's called a Zord or what the hell that's called, but that winged metallic, you know, robotic creature just zapping the hell out of this uh, skeletal skeletal knight. Pretty neat. Pretty neat. Um, so I picked it up. Not a big, not a big uh, Power Rangers fan, to be honest with you. This, this book just spoke to me a little. Another book I picked up this week was Marvel's Running with the Devil, Bullseye Number Two. This is the A cover for the Bullseye line. And, you know, it's this story, if you guys are reading it, it is manic. It's crazy. And Bullseye is there in all of his pathological murderous uh, glory. And he's going down to Colombia to try to save a rich kid uh, from the Colombian cartel. And he's kicking ass and taking numbers on the way. And I really like this cover. It is the Running with the Devil Bullseye number two from Marvel Comics. That is the A cover for the Bullseye. Okay. Another book I picked up. America, number one, and this is the hip hop variant, and I really like it. This is a very clever homage to the Hamilton musical. So those of you who are familiar with musical theater or might have a big um, theater scene in your uh, town or city, you know about uh, the award-winning hip hop musical Hamilton by Lin-Manuel Miranda, and this cover is an homage cover swipe for the America Marvel Comics number one hip hop variant. Really like it. Okay. Another book I picked up this week, Marvel 002 Bullseye. And this is the 1 in 25 B variant. And I really, really like this. The, just the complete menacing look. I think this could even be considered, I'm not even going to say it, but this is, this is a really, really nice book. And it just shows Bullseye's arm to the gills, waiting in the alley. Uh, or maybe stalking someone in an alley, ready to do some business. Really beautiful book. That's the Marvel Bullseye 002 B variant 1 in 25. Okay. And finally, I got America. Fuck yeah. And this is Marvel's number one. It is the C variant. It is a 1 in 25 variant for Miss America. America Chavez in her solo adventures. Uh, this is this wasn't on my digital app when I took lunch today, so I haven't been able to read it yet. But I'm very excited about it, and she's part of the LGBTQ whatever um, community. And I didn't say whatever to be insulting. I said whatever because I, I I'm an all inclusive kind of cat, so that kind of thing is not going to make a difference to me. But you know, it's been part of the marketing spiel from Marvel, so I thought I'd mention it. And um, this is Marvel's number one. It's a variant edition. It is the C cover. It is a one in twenty five cover for America, and she's got that badass number one gold chain on baby um yeah and that's my haul i hope you guys liked it if you did please click like um please leave a comment in the comment section and if you haven't already please click subscribe and that's it i'm chase variant and i'm out